Well, when times are tough, it seems everyone's got advice on how to be successful. Business people often speak about the deals they've brokered. Doctors talk about the psychology of success. But those stories, well, let's face it, they can be boring. <laughs> you know, the fire marshal's having an absolute conniption right now. That was great. I love that. I took my stepson to a concert a couple of years ago, and I was like, what are they holding up? And he looked at me, and he went, cell phones. And I went... Really? <laughs> what happened to the lighters? He goes, what would you need a lighter for? Okay, never mind. <laughs> the people that I still come across each and every day that are successful practice the same four rock star principles. I watched Van Halen and the Rolling Stones and Def Leppard and ZZ Top practice. The four rock star principles of success. We all go onto the same stage every day. I've noticed that the rock stars in any business share these four rock star principles. The first one is passion. They had a true passion for what they did. Let's face it, you're not always going to sell a ticket, and every song you record is not always going to be a hit. But these people had a passion, just like you do. Passion will also get you through things you never in a million years could have imagined. In the 80s, in the mid-80s, Def Leppard was one of the biggest rock bands on the road. Some nice, respectable person just let their inner Def Leppard out over at that table. <laughs> the second corner of your rock star stage, knowledge. That's why you guys are here. What's the one thing Gene Simmons attributes his success to? He said, I read. The third corner of your stage is networking. Networking is relationships, and relationships are everything, whether it's business or personal. Are you gonna, are you gonna trust somebody you don't know, or somebody you know, or somebody that you know recommended? Also, networking is doing things for others without asking for anything in return. That fourth rock star principle, your foundation, is appreciation. I learned about appreciation from Billy Idol, a face only a mother could love. <laughs> By the way, this was in the Summit, which is uh, now Lakewood Church. <laughs> I sent a book to Joel Osteen. Dear Joel, most of the stories in this book happen in your church. <laughs> Please take this, and that is, sometimes you just do something because it's the nice thing to do or it's the right thing to do. What kind of lessons did you learn from them? You know, I learned that, that you have to be responsible for your own success. You have to work hard. You have to know what's going on around you. She's talented. She's on K1. You're listening to Houston's Rock and Roll Authority. Dana Steele on Rock 101. KLOA. Hi, Dana. Well, let's see. I've hung up on Robert Plant in my career, and now I've put Mick Jagger on hold. Well... I apologize for you that. Can, it, <laughs> you wouldn't have been put me on hold for very long, I don't think, for that.